So cross-site scripting is uh, basically the ability for an attacker to uh, execute any content on your website. And uh, attackers usually like uh, use uh, JavaScript when they perform attacks using cross-site scripting. So basically, if some, someone finds an access flow on your website, uh, they can then run their own JavaScript and do whatever your normal web app is doing. As the attacker can execute anything on your website, uh, that also means they control any content. So they can like read usernames and passwords on login forms. Uh, can change the I don't know the, the information in the user settings page and similar things. Can also add or like add or remove whatever content that's available on your website. So whenever you handle user supply data, such as like someone's first name, last name, uh, shipping address and so forth, you must treat it as it, it like it, it can be suspicious and contain bad characters. Say you expect a first name, then numbers maybe shouldn't be allowed and so forth. So be very careful of what data you receive from your users.